Hey, it's Crypto Expert back with another video. And in this video, we're going to talk about a specific problem. It's a problem I'm seeing time and time again, and it's uh, Tron transactions going through and they're failing. And you may have seen uh, something like this. It's, it's trying to execute the smart contract, but it's just not happening. And you come up with this error, then you've got to wait 30 seconds, a minute, and your transaction gets, uh, your funds go out and they come back in, okay, back into your wallet. So don't worry, you don't lose any Tron. It's just that it can be frustrating. We're used to this with Ethereum, okay? But not so much on the Tron blockchain. And there's a couple of reasons for this. And it's basically that you don't have enough bandwidth or energy. Okay, and there's an easy fix to solve this. I want to show you how to do that now. So all you need to do, if you log into your Tron Link wallet, and then you come up here and you click on this little icon up here, and then you go freeze, unfreeze. So this is your wallet. You're going to see the data on your wallet. And as you can see in the middle here, you see resources, and you can see bandwidth. I've got 3,000... 911 and energy I've got no energy at the moment okay so every day you're given 5,000 bandwidth and as you keep on using the Tron blockchain what will happen is your bandwidth will go down your energy will go down and soon you get to a point that it'll drop so low that you have you don't have either or and the transactions are going to fail, once, especially when you start doing the more complicated transaction with uh, smart contracts. Uh, it's just going to fail and you're going to get this error. So what you need to do is, obviously, you need to increase this bandwidth and energy. And how you do that is, you come back to this page here, which I showed you how to get to before, and you go down and click Resources. Okay, so this is going to show you how much energy and bandwidth. So you need to you need to basically get more bandwidth. All right, this here. Okay, so you got this drop down here. You got Tron power and energy, or Tron power and bandwidth. So that's like either or, right? So if you wanna, if you're down on bandwidth, get the bandwidth. If you're down on Tron energy, get the energy, okay? So what you're gonna do is you just, uh, let's say if I wanted to lock up, say five Tron, this is gonna be able to give me uh, basically more energy, all right? And this is, just leave this one here. This will be your address and just click confirm. And it's going to freeze this Tron for at least 72 hours, okay? So you're not going to be able to use it. So whatever you put in here, you're not going to be able to use. But don't worry, it's only a very small amount. I mean, five Trons, literally nothing, okay? So when I go freeze, I'm freezing the energy for this one, okay? Because I'm down on energy. Okay, so remember, we went back to the default setting here. Now I've got, see, now I've got a whole bunch of energy because... I froze up the energy, and if I was down on bandwidth, don't forget you get 5,000 bandwidth a day, then I would freeze up some more um, bandwidth. So that's how you can tell to when your transactions fail, just come to this page and figure out what you need because it'll tell you exactly what you need. Again, just click on the left-hand side, second down says resources, then up here, on the top right it says obtain don't worry about rent just get click obtain and then in this drop down menu figure out whether you need more bandwidth or more energy most of the time it'd probably be more energy okay and just put five or ten tron it's going to be ample if you're doing like ten thousand tron per transaction you're doing ten or twenty of these you're a big whale then you know, you might have to add some more Tron, obviously. Pick what you want, click five or 10, and then freeze up, okay? From my experience, just add five or 10 to each energy or bandwidth, and you should be, you should be good to go. You won't have a drama, and you won't get these foul transactions, which are really annoying, because we're so used to seeing that on Ethereum. 
uh, we don't want to have to deal with that nonsense here on Tron. Okay. All right, guys. So that's it. Hope you enjoyed the video. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Let me know what videos that you want to see, what more content you want to see. Do you want to see tutorials or do you want to see more new uh, low, uh, low cap gems or do you want to see more yield farming? Let me know. Uh, thanks for watching. I really appreciate it and I'll see you in the next video.